Like and subscribe now, or you're going to have bad luck this week. No prehistoric animal is more famous than the Megalodon. Debates about its existence in this day and age have been going on for decades. While many experts definitely say that these monsters are long gone, some still fervently believe that they still roam the Earth's waters. And that's because of evidence like these. Number one might change your mind about the Meg too, so stay tuned. Number 10, the Google Maps sighting. Let's start with the most obvious sighting out there. Since its inception, Google Maps have captured the most bizarre locations ever. It helps us find strange stuff we never believe existed. One time, it showed a picture of something that supposedly looked like a kraken. While people were amazed at the possibilities of this animal's existence, they later realized that the image was just a rock. There are other cases where there's a discovery on the map, and regardless of how scientists try to explain it, it's far beyond them. This footage was captured somewhere in the Bahamas. You can see the silhouette of a giant fish. How are we confident that the animal is colossal? We know because the image was taken by satellites orbiting the Earth. It takes only a large animal to feature on this footage. Could it be a whale shark? If not, what are the possibilities of it being any other animal? Well, if you look closely, you'd realize the image is far from the description of a whale shark. It may be premature to declare it as a megalodon, but the chances are pretty high. Number 9. Megalodon Teeth Have you ever wondered why all beachside souvenir shops sell one of those necklaces with a shark tooth as a pendant? Eh, neither have I. I find those a little too tacky for my taste, but then again, there's a reason why there are a lot of those being sold, and that's not because of some covert black market on shark dentistry. As it turns out, sharks will always have a fresh set of chompers. Their worn out teeth get completely replaced with new ones every couple of weeks or so. That's the reason why the seafloor is littered with them. The Megalodon does the same thing. Now, there's been a lot of controversy involved with found Megalodon teeth. Some of them have been dated to roughly around 10,000 years ago, specifically the ones recovered by the HMS Challenger, which is millions of years after when scientists think the Megalodon went extinct. If the dating is accurate, Megalodons have survived to a far later time than previously thought. Now, if scientists made a mistake with their calculations, who's to say that they didn't make a mistake about declaring them extinct? Number 8. An Unverified Attack Next up is not with an actual sighting, but with the possible outcome of a close encounter with a megalodon. A few years ago, a photo surfaced on the internet showing a beached whale. While seeing a beached whale is already strange in itself, there's something that sets this event apart from the rest. The whale's entire tail is missing, and it looks like it's been bitten off by something large. The most compelling thing about this photo is that you can clearly see bite marks around where the tail should have been. Now, this is a 70-foot humpback whale, one of the largest animals in the ocean. What could have done such a thing? While it's true that orcas or killer whales have a habit of hunting and feeding on whales, it isn't known whether they can take on a whale of this size. Plus, experts believe that the tail was shorn off in one bite. The only animal with the size and strength to possibly do this is, you've guessed it, the mighty Megalodon. Number 7. The Coast Guard Footage Aside from sailors, who obviously spend most of their lives at sea, Coast Guards are the most likely people to spot a Meg and finally confirm that they still roam the world's waters. In their rescue helicopters, they'd have the perfect vantage point to spot anything lurking below the waves. And in this very controversial footage, they might have accidentally found the presumed extinct giant shark. The Brazilian Coast Guard caught sight of the monstrous fish while attempting a sea rescue. At first, the Coast Guard officers didn't notice the giant silhouette swimming past them beneath the waves. But they couldn't believe their eyes after re-watching the footage. If the size of the shadow is any indication, the animal was upwards of 60 feet long. Of course, it could have been just another large fish, primarily the whale shark, but there's one glaring flaw in that assumption. Whale sharks can't be found anywhere in Brazil. Furthermore, the footage has been analyzed by many experts and they found the footage to be completely unaltered. With this, the video has been touted as the best evidence for the continued existence of the Megalodon yet. Number 6. The Zane Grey Account Pearl Zane Grey was an American author and dentist best known for his adventure novels and stories associated with the Western genre in literature and the arts. His best-selling book by far is called Riders of the Purple Sage. Now, I know what you're thinking. What does an award-winning novelist with a penchant for writing westerns have anything to do with megalodons? 
Well, he believes he actually saw one, or rather a shark that's simply too big to be, and I quote, a harmless white shark. In the novel Megalodon Fact or Fiction, Rick Emmer says that Gray claimed to have seen one of the man-eating monsters of the South Pacific, a shark much longer than his 30 to 40 foot boat. Apparently, the shark was yellow and green with a square head, immense pectoral fins, and a few white spots. Now, Gray didn't actually say that he thought the animal he saw was the Mighty Meg. It's too big to be a grade white, and the color certainly rules out whale sharks, so what other shark out there fits the description? Number 5. Meg on the Coast of Brazil The events you're about to see on this deeply shocking video happened on November 20th, 2012. It started off as a pretty normal day on the coast until the Brazilian Coast Guard got a call. There was a swimmer drowning in the sea, and they had to save him. It sounded like a pretty routine rescue mission, and it may have been just that. The Coast Guard got into their helicopters and started looking for the drowning swimmer. The plan was simple. Find him, set a ladder down, and rescue him. Pretty standard, right? Now, the Coast Guard often attaches cameras to their helicopters. This is done for record keeping and training purposes. As they approached the rescue spot, the camera caught something extremely disturbing. Just near where the swimmer was begging for help, there appeared to be a huge shadow passing beneath the waves. It was certainly not a white whale as the shadow was much bigger than that, and it couldn't have been an orca either. There's only one explanation. It was a megalodon. Look at the video again and tell us what you think. Do you think the shadow beneath the waves was a megalodon or not? Number 4. Megalodon Disturbs Kayak It would be scary enough if you were on a boat like other people on this list and seen a megalodon, but can you imagine anything more terrifying than kayaking around in the ocean when suddenly you spot the world's biggest shark ever? Well, this is exactly what happened to one man and it was caught on tape. At first, everything was normal with this kayaker, and he was just enjoying his day off. That was when, all of a sudden, a massive aquatic beast swims right by him. You can see him turn his kayak and try and row away to avoid certain doom. Just imagine how terrifying it would be having a megalodon sneak up on you. Number 3. David Stead and the Giant Fish Australian naturalist David Stead shared an unusual experience in his books, Sharks in the Rays of the Australian Seas. Many people believe the story describes an encounter the author had with a shark. He spoke with several crayfish fishermen who were so scared of a shark that they encountered in Broughton Islands that they refused to return there for many days. They claimed to have seen an animal of an unbelievable magnitude. Stead questioned all the men involved and realized they had a similar story. They were sure about the monstrous size. While some said it measured over 115 feet, others said the water around it boiled wherever it passed. Going by their description, it could be true that this is another case of sighting the mighty Meg. Number 2. The Black Demon of Cortez In the Sea of Cortez, there are elusive and gigantic black sharks swimming in the waters. They're said to be predators like the great whale, but are dark black and have a massive tail. It's been rumored to be aggressive to humans and would often attack boats. In 2018, Eric Mack alleged that one attacked his ship. If this animal truly exists, it's certainly more extensive than the great whale and is possibly dark in color because of whatever the opposite of albinism is. This animal is believed to have been seen off Mexico's coast. Reports say that their size is comparable to the Meg. Eric confirmed it when he narrated his encounter with the animal. While this animal is real, it's unclear if it's related to the Megalodon or the same animal. Number 1. The Deep Blue The Deep Blue Sea is home to many of the world's unexplored creatures. There's nothing you wouldn't find. Here, a group of divers watch tiger sharks feeding off a decomposed sperm whale when a giant shark passes by. One of the divers, who has several years of experience studying sharks, said it could be Deep Blue one of the giant sharks in history based on its markings and size. The animal was so big that experts didn't know what to call it. The first thing that came to mind was that it was, yeah, you guessed it, a megalodon, given that it measured over 20 feet. Kimberly Jeffries is a diver and photographer who also witnessed the giant shark. She confirmed the photos and called it one of the biggest sharks ever found, but deep down, she wants to connect to the meg because their features are so similar. Do you believe the Megalodon exists today? Let us know in the comments. 
And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.